Chaos! Make sure it's over there. Wait. Crud! It's on, it's on, it's on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And just put a hold so there's no mistake in that. <laughs> this guy, man. Hi. All right, so we're back again yeah. with the man, yeah. the myth, the legend, yeah. Koji. Luther Van Koji, a.k.a. Pablo West Koji, a.k.a. Koji Accolades, a.k.a. You're done already. Radical. <laughs> All right, man. That was a great Let's go. performance. Let's go. What's happening? What's on your mind? All right, what's on my mind is, I was looking for some answers. Oh, there's a ring there's a ring And this is where you cut to the footage of everyone fucking singing it because it's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Man, so obviously today is the day that he's revealed the name of his album, yeah. Reason to Smile. Yeah. Do you want to tell us why it's named that, man? Do you know what happened? Basically, when I was writing this album, um, I felt like there was loads of good stuff happening for me and I couldn't see the reason why I was meant to be happy. Hmm. So everything... I was doing was trying to remind myself why I should find joy in certain things and it, it was really the, the lessons and the, the wisdom that came from my mother that kind of drove me forward and she was always just like find a reason to smile you know what I mean so that's what my album's called so like this is Quali this is Quali Quali Black, Black. Um, what are you saying um, he just dropped, huh? a, he just dropped an EP I'm good man how you doing he just dropped the EP he's I'm gonna play it modest What's the EP called? Call me when it's over. Call him when it's over. Call me. Right. Because, because, because. <laughs> no, don't say it. <laughs> no, don't say it. <laughs> <laughs> so. <laughs> Wait, let me just, nah, I'm gonna put you, I'll put you on blast. Put me on blast. He said, why was I not on track three? Track three. When I invited you to see come the, studio, when I invited you to come studio, where were you? I was working on Reason to Smile, out, out March 4th. He was. Out March 4th. Pre ordered the album right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Yeah. Right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. <laughs> but Where's we need to go to studio. Hey, Abel gave it to me. Swear down. Uh, let's talk. <laughs> let's talk. Let, let's me and you took him. You know when you get in trouble with your parents, you go, Mom. Mom. <laughs> Where are you no going? Box. No box. Where are you going? Uh, he's waiting. Anyway, absolutely. So, my name is Cody Black. I am a rapper too. Um. This is dope. This is crazy. And that was really, really, really lit. What's your name? Hazim. Hazim. Nice to meet you, brother. Nice to meet you. Pleasure to meet you, bro. Likewise. You, you, you wait there, huh? You did an amazing thing today. Oh, thank you. You are an amazing person. Thank you. You're waved. Yes. Very waved. Reason um, to smile. March 4th. We're out here. We still got questions, though. We still okay. got questions. Okay. Colin? Okay. Yeah, so. How is it to like expose your vulnerabilities in your work? Like, is that a hard thing to do? What's the process behind that and the thought, the train of thought? I always think about what's going to be left behind. Mm. I think not everyone gets a chance to know you in the now, but like they get time with your work later on and they find their own reasons to make it important. You know, the amount of times people come up to me and say, can't go back, got me through this or that. I didn't write that song going, I want to make a song that's gonna, you get me? I wrote my feelings down, people saw themselves in it. It's the easiest way for me to tell my truth and, and also relate to people because as, as excited as I am and I'm like happy, I'm happy now, my mm. album's coming out, March 4th. Anyway, <laughs> but normally I'm quite reserved, you know what I'm saying? So finding them relation points with people is quite difficult. So music does that for me as long as I'm honest. All right, man. And my final question. Wait, no. We still got two more questions. Right. So what was the process making the album? Was it like, did it all come to you at once? Or did the songs like come to you over a span of time? It was hard. I had writer's block for a while. And then I stopped writing. Mm. I, wrote, I wrote most of this album off the top of my head. Um, <laughs> I wrote most of this album from the top of my head because I feel like if you got writer's block, don't write. Mm. You're not blocked. You're the writer. Maybe the, maybe the action of seeing the words back and, and judging yourself is stopping you. But for the most part, you're able to do whatever you want to do, whenever you want to do it. So I just started reacting to music rather than trying to write music. Yeah. 
I felt that. This guy's spitting facts. He's spitting facts. What so, I, I mean, you saw me. Wait, you just see me sorting up that mosh pit in the middle, man. Yeah. Ah, man. Energy. Energy. Respectfully. <laughs> so, I heard you saying up there, man. Lex is your favorite artist. Yeah. How, how, why is that? Lex is my favorite artist because whenever I am uninspired, I look for the nearest person that's going to make me want to write again. Lex makes me want to write every time I hear her. She's so skilled and so special. It's different. And, um, and I, hate, I hate the term female rap. I think female rap is a myth. It's not a Absolutely. Myth. It's not a thing. They're, they're heavy. They're barras. Sims, Lex, Tia Carries, fucking... Every, like, everyone, even... Did you hear Ray Black spitting on her last album? Stop playing. Man. Everyone's cold. Everyone's just. Everyone should be allowed to be who they are. Shabo's daily duppy, man. Shabo's daily duppy. Shabo's out of me recently as well. We, we we do to get some music as well. It's all happening. It's all happening over here. You heard it here it's first. All, it's all happening. All right, man. Well, it's really been good seeing you again, man. You really did like. Great job. You get me. Hey, hey. Reason to smile, March 4th, 2022, pre-order my album, and um... <laughs> you got to give us the backstage for the concert, man.